Hi all, Daniel here from Quantum Blast. We're here today to talk about the three main mesh sizes that are available in the market today when purchasing your garnet. We're going to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of all three and what type of blasting they're best suited for. When choosing your garnet, it's important to consider whether it's blast to waste or whether you plan on re recycling your garnet. So the three types of garnet that we're looking at today is 80 mesh, 3060 mesh and 2040 mesh. So whilst garnet is generally sold in mesh sizes, it's important to understand the particle size of each of the garnets. So if we start with the 2040 mesh, micron size are between 841 and 400 micron. 3060 mesh, 595 micron and 250 micron. And 80 mesh generally should be 177 micron. It's important to remember the higher the number, the smaller the particle size. So today, 2040 is the largest particle, whereas 80 is the smallest particle. What mesh size is suitable for what? If you're looking to get multiple use out of your garnet, where you're cycling continuously through the booth, maybe that's when it's time to look at a 2040 mesh garnet. So the first pass through your unit will leave somewhere around 85 to 125 micron profile. 3060 will leave a 60 to 100 micron profile and is also very popular in the blasting industry for those who are looking to recycle through their booth. Whilst the first two are ideal for recycling, they're not always the best option. 80 mesh leaves the ideal micron size for coating and is between 60 and 100 micron. Many people believe that larger the mesh size, the faster you're gonna blast. This couldn't be further from the truth. Out of the three that we've got here today, 80 mesh will actually give you your best coverage on any substrate and be the most efficient garnet to use. When looking at the specifications of and or requirements of your job, there's two things that you have to consider. One is a surface profile and the other is a surface cleanliness. Surface profile is measured in microns and is the difference between the maximum height and the anchor point of your substrate. Surface cleanliness is measured in a class but we'll go into that in another video. So it's always important to check your specifications on surface profile requirements when picking your mesh size garnet.